I hope you have a great day. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to design this circular organization chart in PowerPoint. Keys that I am using during the design, you can see at the below bar, follow these keys and watch the video till the end. Go to format background, I am going to give it some different color. I am going with uh, this color, so select this one. Go to insert and uh, take an old shape and drag an old shape by holding shift alt. let me give it some control d to duplicate it and make it a little bit smaller in size by holding shift alt and put it here at this side again control d to duplicate it and put it on the other side of the center or hollow shape yes again shape outline make it no outline now select this one and give it some different color sorry oh sorry yes let me shape outline make it no outline shape will give the recent color and uh, i'm going to take a rectangle let me drag a rectangle oh sorry this is a star so i'm going again to take a rectangle drag a rectangle horizontally like this from uh, this small all shape to the center all shape again control d to duplicate it and uh, this uh, line goes from a uh, center all shape to the left uh, to the right side small all shape select all these shapes and go to merge shape union okay i should give it some gradient color i think to all this uh, shape i am going to give it some gradient color and uh, i only need first of all i need only three stops here so let me select this color select this stop and uh, by eyedropper i'm selecting this one color and uh, select the next one stop and uh, by through eyedropper i'm going to give it the next one color direction from uh, left to right or right to left okay i am going to uh, distribute the gradient so i need two stops more to distribute the gradient in these all shapes and give the same color as the center all shape color and also to this top the recent color and now I am going to make the gradient sorry let me yes okay and uh, yes i'm going to take an old shape and drag a big old shape by holding shift alt and put it here make it a little bit smaller i think so shape fill no fill edit shape i I'm going to select this anchor point, open path, and delete this anchor point. Also, delete this anchor point. Let me select this half circle and make it a little bit smaller. Okay, go to shape format, outline and make it width to, I think 3 will be okay. And give the same color as this side, all shape color. 
and send to back. Go to insert and take an all shape and drag an all shape by holding shift alt and give some gradient color okay let me fill to the gradient color so i need only two stops so i am going to delete the extra stop i'm going to give this stop the gray one color and this will be white direction from up to down also give the line gradient remember that the line gradient will be inverse to the fill gradient and in this case the gradient will be from down to up direction so it will be inverse from the fill gradient I am going to make it switch to 1.75 give it some shadow effect increase the transparency to 70 one or two size and uh, okay it's okay control D to duplicate it and put it here shape outline give the same color as uh, this side color Control D to duplicate it and put it here. You can increase or decrease according to your uh, company employees these shapes. Let me select all these side shape and control D to duplicate it and uh, flip uh, horizontally. Yes, and uh, put it on the other side. Let me fix these old shape over this half circle. And later on I will change the color of this side according to the color. Send to back. Sorry, let me select and change the color deselect select this one and send to back I am going to bring and apply this uh, icon so go to insert and bring it to the slide make it a little bit bigger in size by holding shift alt and put it at the center up this let me give it a base up uh, this white all shape and uh, put it here at the center of the first all shape and uh, bring to front make it little bit smaller according to the size of the all shape and uh, control D to duplicate it and put it on every all shape these employee icon you can also put here your employees pictures
let me select this one and delete so it is an extra all shape so i'm going to delete that one select this side and go according to the same color of this side select the center one and uh, go this color select this one this one this one this one and uh, this one and go same color up uh, yes let me bring some text to the slide control c and uh, control v to bring it to the slide that i typed earlier to save the time so i'm going to put the organization chart text here under the center all shapes so let me type the organization chart sorry hit enter and uh, align center select align center and make it a little bit smaller here you can put uh, a position and employees name so i'm going to put some, these text here in front of all these employees and his, their positions their names and their position you can put here Thank you for watching.